Hey guys, Stephanie Mitchell here. I'm an online marketing coach for beauty business owners. And today I'm sharing five secrets to making Facebook and Instagram ads that work like crazy to grow your business in 2021. So whether you're a hairstylist, esthetician, lash and brow artist, makeup artist, listen up because I'm going to share with you my secrets for making ads that convert and do crazy good things for your business this year. So whether you're starting out small, if you're in a new location, if you just opened up, or even if you're busy and thriving, there are always so many good reasons to run Facebook and Instagram ads in your business. Just think about all the exciting seasons that are coming up right now in the fall. We've got Halloween, we've got Thanksgiving in the USA, Black Friday, Christmas, so much good stuff happening in the next few months. Now imagine if you could sell out of your creative promotions for the holiday season, double your gift card sales or your retail product sales, introduce yourself to a ton of new clients, all of that is possible with Facebook and Instagram advertising. So you know those sponsored posts that you see on Facebook and Instagram, maybe you've paid attention to them, maybe you always just ignore them. No matter what you're feeling towards them is right now, I'm gonna hit you with a truth bomb. They work super well for beauty businesses. I wanna share with you quickly what one of my students, Yvette, told me. I was just on the phone with her this week. Yvette is an esthetician and a day spa owner in San Antonio, Texas. And she was telling me about what happened with her Facebook and Instagram ads. So listen up, this is super exciting. She put together a package for a facial and massage, which are her two most popular services. She packaged them together into a special promotion. This package cost $155 dollars and she wanted to introduce her day spa to more clients so what she did is she put together a facebook and instagram ad she did a video touring people around her day spa introducing her business to people and she turned that video into a promoted post and here's what happened so cool i love hearing these stories she promoted this ad for the first week she spent $30 on it the first week, so not too much money. And she had 15 new clients book appointments with her. And she was like, oh my gosh, this really works. She paused it for the weekend, then she started it again on Monday the next week to see what would happen. 20 new clients booked with her for this day spa package the second week. So total 35 clients that booked with her who were new to her business, $5,425 in revenue just for this package. And on top of that, she told me that a bunch of these clients ended up upselling, they ended up indulging and purchasing a $40 add-on to their facial. So that was hundreds of dollars more in revenue. Plus there's all the potential retail product sales. A lot of these clients ended up rebooking. Then you have the referrals, the reviews, all of the good stuff that comes from having new clients. She ended up with thousands and thousands of dollars in revenue just from spending $60 on ads. And I wanted to tell that to you to really encourage you and show you how well Facebook and Instagram ads can work when they're done right. So today I wanna to share with you my five secrets to making sure that your Facebook and Instagram ads work like a charm to build your beauty business. Let's get into it. So secret number one is have a video in your ad. Now, I see so many hairstylists and estheticians and beauty business owners take a photo from their newsfeed or from their Instagram feed and just promote it. And of course, like your hair photos and your lash photos and your makeup photos, they're beautiful, but they will not convert as well as a video. We wanna see like who we're making an appointment with. We wanna know who you are as a beauty pro. We don't wanna feel like you're a stranger. We wanna feel like we actually know you before booking with you. And a video is the best way to introduce yourself to people. So this video doesn't need to be super long. 60 seconds or less is perfect. It doesn't need to be professional. You don't need to hire like a film crew or anything like that. Just using your phone is perfect. You might want to get someone to help you film this video and just make it really personal. Introduce yourself, show people around your space a little bit. If you're advertising like a service or a treatment, make sure to put some clips in there where you show yourself doing that service or that treatment with a client. You can also, if you're editing your video, you can put in a few pictures to show some like before and afters. 
point is make it really personal and make people feel welcomed in with this video. If pictures say a thousand words, trust me, videos say a million words and they make it so much easier to sell what you are advertising. So do not skip out on doing a video for your ad. Okay, my second secret is this. You wanna be advertising something specific, a promotion. You don't just wanna say that you are a salon or you're a hairstylist, you're an esthetician, and that you're accepting new clients. Imagine an ad where, let's say you're a waxer, and you just say, hey, I am in a waxing specialist. I have a waxing studio. If you wanna get waxed, book an appointment with me, and that's it. That is not going to convert very well. What will happen in this case is if people see your ad, they'll be like, oh cool, next time I need to get like a bikini wax or get my legs waxed, maybe I'll check her out. So they follow you and then they forget all about you. It's sad, but it's true. To really convert those strangers into bookers, you need to give them something special, something limited time, limited quantity, a special promotion that you normally do not offer. That could be like something like Yvette did for her day spa. She packaged up a facial and a massage and put them together into a special package. There are literally thousands of ways that you can make this promotion special, limited time, limited quantity, and make it be profitable to you and also really exciting to new clients. I actually have a video that I did last week where I show you my formula for packaging up profitable, irresistible promotions. You can click below to watch that video. But the bottom line is you need something special to promote in your ad. You don't just wanna talk about the fact that you're a hairstylist or an esthetician. You wanna advertise something specific do not skip this step. Okay, the third thing that you need for an irresistible ad campaign is an amazing caption. So your video is what's gonna get people's attention and get them to pay attention to your ad, but your caption is gonna be what's going to convert them into bookings. So you need to give it the special attention that it deserves. Your caption should be oozing with personality and fun and really sharing who you are as a person. You don't wanna come across as a boring, faceless business. You really want your caption to share who you are as a person. So how do you do this? First of all, introduce yourself so many people skip this step they just write a caption sharing you know this is what my balayage looks like or what do you think of these russian volume lashes we don't care about that as much as we care about who you are so introduce yourself tell them a bit about you about your experience in your job what you love about what you do and the fact that this is your business then tell them about your promotion what you're offering what the benefits are and why they are going to love it after that, you're gonna give them specific directions about how to book an appointment with you because you wanna get that booking with them. So I actually have a whole formula that I teach to create irresistible captions that convert in my program, the Facebook formula for salons. You can check it out at the link below. It reopens in October. But for now, just remember that your caption needs to have all of that great information about what you're offering, but it also needs to really introduce yourself and make people feel welcome, just like your video. So do not skip this either. So this brings me to the next thing that your ad absolutely needs to have, which is an easy way to book with you because here's the thing we never want to spend money on anything that's gonna lead to just like getting more followers or getting more likes and comments or just increasing visibility no my budget is going towards things that I can actually measure the return on investment in which I'll get into in just a second but we never want to pay for things like likes and follows etc we want the real hard cash and we want the bookings. So what your ad really needs is a super simple way for people to be like, oh my gosh, I need that. I want to get an appointment with her and they can book that appointment within 60 seconds of seeing your ad. So to make that seamless, there's actually a little button right there underneath of your ad video that people can click on to bring them to different places. Now, a lot of people will have like a button that leads to their Instagram page, which we do not want. Again, we need to make it seamless for them to book. So that button there, there are a couple places that you can make it lead to. First of all is your website. If you've got a good website, if you talk about the package that you're advertising on your website, make that button link over to your website. But my actual favorite way of booking an appointment from your ads is to connect that button and connect your ads to Facebook Messenger 
or Instagram DMs so that people can send you messages, ask questions, get their questions answered. You can give them more information and then you can give them all the info to choose an appointment day and time with you. I especially love Facebook Messenger because you can set up automated messages to automatically answer people's questions, even without you being there responding to them on your phone all the time. So, so many cool options, but again, Bottom line is make it simple and seamless for people to book an appointment with you and tell them in your ad how to book with you. Spell it out, make it super clear. Here's my last tip for you. You need to keep an eye on your numbers. You need to look at your analytics whenever you spend money on an ad. Do not just throw $20 into a sponsored post and then come back a week later and be surprised about what's happening. You need to keep an eye on your numbers. To make your ads work, you need to be vigilant. Whenever I have an ad that's running, I always go in every single day and just check on it. It only takes five minutes, but it's so important to look at your different numbers because you might end up needing to tweak a few things or adjust a few things to get it to work right for you. So I look at things like number of impressions, number of leads or messages received, appointments or sales made from it, how much I'm spending versus how much I'm making. That's your return on investment. So it's funny because sometimes I'll have a student that comes to me and says something like, Stephanie, I just did an ad for one week and I spent $20. I had 10 people message me, but out of those 10 people, only two people ended up booking an appointment with me. What am I doing wrong? And then I say to them, hang on a second. So you actually had two people book appointments with you. How much is each of those appointments worth? And then they'll say something like, well, it's $100. So it's, I'm selling a $100 package. Okay, I'll say, so you just sold two $100 packages. So you made $200. Is that right? Well, yeah, it's right. And you only spent $20. Yeah, I spent $20. So what you're telling me is you spent $20 and you made $200. So that's a 10 times return on investment. Plus on top of that, you've got the retail sales that come from that. Hopefully one, if not both of those clients rebooked with you. So you get the additional revenue after, uh, maybe you upsold them during their appointments on some more um, indulgent upsells. So it's not just the $200, it's more than that too. And then my students realize that it's really important to look at those numbers and understand what your real return on investment is for your ads. And I want you to do the same thing. I want you to look at how much you're making and how much you're spending. Is it worth it? Do you need to tweak something? And maybe do you need to just realize like, hey, I am getting really good results with these ads once I look at what my sales actually are. Sometimes you'll be pleasantly surprised and sometimes even shocked at how well they work when you really dig into the numbers. So remember when they're done right, Facebook and Instagram ads can be an amazing source of new leads, new sales, new connections, and just a sustainable way to continuously grow your business. I've worked with hundreds of beauty businesses now, and these five things make all the difference in creating an amazing ad campaign that actually converts. Remember to have these things, an amazing video, an irresistible promotion, a captivating caption, an easy way to book, and keeping an eye on those numbers and on your return on investment. If you wanna learn more about Facebook and Instagram ads and get your toes wet, to launch your first ad campaign, be sure to download my social ads kickstart guide for beauty pros. You can download it at the link below in this video. And if you want to really finally find a sustainable way to build, market, and promote your business, I'd love to invite you into my VIP program, the Facebook Formula for Salons. It reopens in October, so in just a few weeks, you can get on the wait list and get all the information at the link below this video. I hope that you enjoyed this. Uh, if you liked it, be sure to leave a like below and I'll see you again next week for another salon marketing video.